I started my career long back when, <laughs> uh, but it always been in a marketing background. Marketing is actually what I'm very passionate about. But uh, I was moving from B 2 C and then B 2 B. Then I found my passion actually uh, more into B 2 B. I work for um, before join B 2 B. It was B 2 C. I work for different varieties industries such as like. lifestyle fashion those kind of thing like very girly then i move my passion to b2b which actually i found my fondness towards uh, technology i used to work from several tech company then now i'm here uh, in a blockchain technology payment space uh i found it very interesting and i bet like in the future uh, payment it will be um revolving and then it will Um, move to, towards more innovative for us to have in daily basis. Okay, um, daily basis as uh, vice president of marketing. Actually, uh, as you are aware, we are a startup. It is basically a startup life, so um, it's uh, extremely challenging because the landscape itself, the ecosystem itself, it keep changing gradually. And then, uh, since the industry is fairly new, so we keep learning every day. There is news, there is regula- regulation, or even the trends itself, um, creating some obstacles for me and my team and. or uh, per se as the company itself. So I always start my day with um, a good start of the day. I will say I go to the gym at 6 a.m. for two hours. After that, I always uh, actually run my goals for a day and what my team goals on that day. So I because I really like when um, being productive actually. I would like to have my team also be the same and in each week uh, we actually achieving something even though there is a bottleneck uh, we facing bottleneck I would like me and my team work together to find a problem solver for each issues we are facing um I found that actually during my um day to day and I learned by doing as well in terms of blockchain because it's fairly new the industry and then when it comes to payment as well for blockchain based the KYC that know your customer is number one and number two will be security and real-time uh, process trans payment process because as you are aware uh, we as a customer even like me when we pay something um, or like we, when we do transaction we always um, actually how to say insecure about oh if if uh, whether our data personal data is it actually safe to be giving it to the bank or whoever we're giving it or third party are uh, the one who actually recorded our credit cards or any details basically um, especially if it's connected to our account right so payment and um, security is very um, important they are uh, bound to be together and has, it has to come hand in hand together in for of us to deliver excellent and seamless service So basically that payment is part of our daily basis. You cannot miss a day without any transaction which mean payment transaction can hold in sentimental value or something dear to our heart. For example, if you are a student, you have been saving your pocket money to go to that particular concert or remember on the day when you actually purchased your first house, first car. right um, basically uh, it brings a joy sense of satisfaction and validation for ourselves we want to tear up what's pay moments campaign to every special and sentimental moment in our lives that is not every transaction is actually about mater- material things and it can be also a sentimental that's our goals in what's pay moments That soon everything will be digitalized and um, and cashless as well. Uh, as you can see, um, in the in form of investment, currently we can also invest something digital. We call it like digital assets, right? And um, 
So in the future, as you are aware, um, all the countries already plan uh, their digital on the on digital currency, official on digital currency like stable coins. So basically, at the concept of in NFT as well. So um, the trends that we need to be need to watch on it would be um, digital investment as NFT and digital currency because it will be it will grow and evolve in the future we might have something else I and mean, maybe it's not nft maybe something else but similar into that concept so we own everything digital basically so um the excitement i'm looking forward is actually uh, not only the innovation ba uh, on uh, what's pay technology but also the um, innovation on the industry itself as you are aware uh, we are um, the, the actually when the ecosystem or the environment triggered by uh, innovation it will impact us uh, on day day to be day to day basis um, i think i find that it will be very interesting to see how we actually deal with these changes in the future. Oh, I would like to have a better understanding or maybe like start myself early to uh, have a better knowledge of digital currency and how actually investment can also involve, right? Not only payment, because you are aware um, long back when uh, investment is only like um, the conventional investment would be like savings, deposits, something like that, right? But these days, we can also invest in on digital, um, something digital that is not tangible, which is I find it very interesting. If I knew that in the beginning, then it would be a great deal for my current career now.